So welcome back to my favorite schoolhouse rock episode, Deadly Preposition. How long have you been waiting to use that one? I don't know. I just thought of it while the loading screen was happening. I somehow don't believe you, but okay. <laughs> I feel like you've been waiting for that. Yeah, that does not You're sound like, like a joke that you just came up with on the spot. I did. I'm going to use this like 40 when we're like a third of the way done with the game. <laughs> you thought you thought of a preposition like last week and you're like, how can I use preposition in the playthrough and it'll make it funny? And oh, then you're like, man. Schoolhouse Rock, and then everyone didn't laugh. <laughs> hey, remember that show, Schoolhouse Rock? Hey, remember references? <laughs> well, I guess no more Schoolhouse Guffy, Rock, Schoolhouse Guffy, Rock references. put Tom's head on the, on the I'm just a bill guy. 50 years ago. <laughs> He's just a bill on Capitol Hill, guys. Actually, make the bill the can of pickles. Zach, that means we need to head for the sheriff's department. Ooh. Ooh. Sorry, everyone. In case make you it heard all, that. Make it all weird and awkward over, over here. <laughs> that's, oh, how I, that's how over I like here. it. So you're in your Dapper Dan suit. Yep. It's the most important part of the playthrough at this point. How many do, do you have? You have that one. I think we have five or six. We, no, you we have, have the like hearts. Four. You have the hearts one. I know that. Yeah. The stupid looking one. How do I get out of here? We go through that gate. But I think this is. Do you have to leave to go to a location? Yeah. Okay. He has to I go couldn't to the, remember um, where we left off. He has to go to the, the um, police uh, police building station. The police Banquet. Sto the police store. He has to go to the box. <laughs> the cop. Manor. Send more cops! Um, <laughs> you made that joke last time. We I know! I like it still. Um, what was it? Uh, yeah, no, he has to go to the uh, police office to find the files about the... Uh, police office? I don't fucking know what I'm saying anymore. Call the police! Call the church! Call, Call the, the church, church police! Ah, uh, Monty Python. Python. <laughs> Birds of fucking. How are we doing again? When you're like, I know more Monty Python quotes than I know that I need to know. <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. You, hey, that's talk to we, your invisible friend. Anyway, Zach. That's when we were talking about. Um, oh, there aren't it. He likes some young. And Emily could be targeted next. You can't rule that out. Oh, don't rule it out. Cop killer. Cop killer. Cop killer. <laughs> However that song goes, <laughs> cop killer. <laughs> It's very abundantly clear from that rendition that you have never heard that song before. You're saying she's interesting. You know, as an in interesting person. But by looking interesting as does in anybody, her vagina. Does everybody else know notice the center line just kind of loading in as we drive? Like back when I first met you. Oh! Does it, what, who was that? It was Richard. Oh. That's fine. Little dicky. No, I'm noticing that the center line is like... A higher th up than the road is, like it looks like, like the it's further out it goes. Like it's a rate, like it's raised up. Yeah. Yeah. Raise the the line is raised up to Zion. Jaja people. God damn it. Um, I don't even know why. That was really street stretching for that one. Where are you going? Stretching. I'm stopping because you said Jaya Zion right now. Well, you don't Fuck like you. You don't like payable on death. <laughs> God damn it. I like Payable on Death for like a week in like 2003. South Town? Is that, uh, was that one of their songs? I, I don't think even so, know. yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, you and about everyone about else. Uh, uh, you, about you're about everyone else. So everyone liked it for about a week and then yeah. that was it. Yep. That's how that goes. That band. Fucking P.O.D. If you liked P.O.D. longer than a week, leave a comment. Let us know how long you've been a fan of P.O.D. <laughs> you're I don't you're in you P.O.D. <laughs> Come join us in the studio so we can talk about our love for P.O.D. that one week in, and in we, high school. <laughs> and we can make an event on Facebook saying that you're going to be here at a at a local Kogo's for one night only concert. <laughs> like that meme that's been going around. Oh, uh, shit. Who was that initially? Was it Limp Biscuit? Check out Limp Biscuit at fucking at the Sunoco on, in <laughs> Oakland or whatever it was. Yeah. Ah, shit. That's where Limp Bizkit should play. But did you know they have a record deal? Still? Come you see, come see Twisted and Guy Fieri at the <laughs> Cracker Barrel. You know, where they, you know where they should play? They should play in the 
in the space between the Cadoba and the pizza place in Oakland that that kid fell through that made Matt national news. <laughs> it was a Cadoba and a Brugger's Bagel. Oh, yeah, it was a Brugger's Bagel. I thought, I thought it was a pizza place. <laughs> so, yeah, someone on my Instagram the night that happened at like a letter, not Instagram, my uh, Snapchat posted something. He's like, yeah, one of your idiot friends and one of your idiot classmates tried to jump the jump the building and miss. And it just said, oh, and there were just like cops everywhere. Oh, God. Classy. Keeping it classy. Hey, did you ever notice this? Have and you the ever? L is coming down and fucking the K in the ass. <laughs> classy. <laughs> Sorry. Did you on. ever notice that you never see the fat guy from ICP and Guy Fieri in the same room? And the lead singer of Smash Mouth? Right. Never seen them. You've never seen them in the same room. They're the same person. <laughs> Just a three-headed monster. Hey, you know what? Diners oh, here we go. and dives. How do Look, those work? I told you. You ever notice how you don't never see Emily and the raincoat oh. killer in the same, same, so same room? He's so pissed he was there. The raincoat killer is a phantom made up to scare children long ago. I can't believe you fell for that from Harry, of all people. I agree with George. Harry likes to play with people. Play with their minds, too. He likes to fiddle with their buttholes. <laughs> George. I was going to say penis, Emily. and I went for butthole. Of course I don't believe him. Or Ugh, or don't or stop. Don't. But You're missing the hand head. gesture. I I'm saw the hand head. gesture. No, That's you why I saw you it. Stop. I'm telling the people at home. <laughs> me pantomiming a thumb going in a butt. Well, then. George likes Did killing things, apparently. He's hunting and killing. He likes hunting and killing with George. He likes shot guns. Very well. Him and Sean Michaels. And he also likes whatever fo football team that Pennant has on it. Go sports team. <laughs> go my favorite sports team. <laughs> Make oh, the gold 15, basket unit. It can hold 15 plus one bullets. There is. Um, oh, I'm just magically here. Yeah, this is the this is the, the basement for the police office building. They're here too, Zach. Don't ever call it cop store. The cop place. <laughs> don't ever cop call store. <laughs> call. Don't ever call it the thing it actually is. Just call it the cop store or the police <laughs> office building. It's the police manor, is what it is. Police manor. Remember to get out your fucking infinite gun. There you go. You're good. You got this. You almost hit that guy all the way in the back too. Did you notice that? Please, the aim isn't aiming isn't that great in this game. Well, he did. He he shot oh, he him did. like once in the back. That's why he was already aggroed. Oh, aggro, aggro, aggro. Um, I don't like that their hips like do that weird swaying motion. The uh, their hips don't lie. Yeah, is that right, Danzig? <laughs> Cue that clip. Go 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 go! <laughs> I like, I like when Bushy was like, wow, I really like this song. I should listen to the actual song. And he's like, no, it's not as good. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> no. So, yeah, apparently Danzig uh, with the Misfits happened. Yeah. Apparently it was George super Lewis. fucking awesome. Really? Still yeah. Missing a vital piece of the puzzle. Huh. I don't remember. He had, they had somebody. Do really they play that awesome, that awesome song they do with Danzig? You know, uh, Lost in Space. Yeah, yeah. The very the that's very, that's a, that's a joke. That's only a joke if you're if you're a fan of the Misfits because you know Danzig didn't sing that song. That's a joke. Oh, what? Bird explains the joke. Thank you for explaining the joke. I'll explain it's the joke for everyone. A it's because she's a Scot. I got a medium. Hey Tom. Yeah. It's medium. Medium. What kind of med kit is it? It's a medium. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. Yeah, apparently Danzig with the Misfits happened, so that was a good time. I watched a couple of clips online. It's pretty entertaining. They do a really good job. Oh, there it is. Because when I saw Danzig, he, he looked like a wispy cancer patient and sang like somebody farted in his throat before he came out on stage. So he died of cancer, turned into a ghost, and farted in his own mouth. Is that yes. what you're saying? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Because when you're a ghost, you can like disembody yourself. <sighs> so he took his own ass off and farted in it, <laughs> in his mouth. Well, yeah. If you're a ghost, you on. just you just stretch your. Have you not watched cartoons? You just stretch your bottom wispy part up right into your mouth. <gasps> ah! That actually spooked me. 
I'm not gonna lie, I was spooked. <laughs> I can't believe that actually got oh, me. Oh, good job, game. Um, I think you're good on all of these now, unless you're searching for items. Are you searching for donuts? Because you got the one clue that you needed. Okay. <coughs> hey, you can turn that flashlight on and off? I didn't know that. Yeah. Shit. He really hasn't needed it, though. No. <laughs> Honestly. There has not been a room that has been dark enough for him to need nope. it at all. Remember what we said about the reticle, bird? If it's not on something, you're not shooting at anything. Because that's how the game works. Yes. Ooh. Ooh, crap block. Here comes Lindsay Lohan. So we kind of talked about this before, but... um, They're dropping we, a lot of shotgun shells. Yeah. Oh, yeah I know. I want to point that out. Uh, you saw... We still don't have the shotgun, I don't think. You saw a movie. Oh, yeah. I saw yoga hosers. It wasn't and bad. I didn't like Tusk, so if you didn't like Tusk, let me tell you the differences. So it washes the, the terrible uh, taste of Tusk in your mouth? Yeah. And, like, do you have to watch watch Tusk to understand no. anything in this? Because I know they're... They like, reference it, like, twice, and that's about it. Okay. You know, in, in what way do they reference it? I they just, just they mentioned the fact that, that the two girls from the shop so, uh, aided in the investigation to help find him. That was it. How did I don't even remember them doing that? Because they talked to Guy Lapointe. Oh yeah, is that guy in it? Let me tell you a story. Okay. The story of yoga hosers and how Johnny Depp is the most ingenious man ever to exist. Really? He's is that really good? good at it? He is one of the main characters in the movie. Yeah. And when you thought to yourself, man, I wish they had more of this dumb French character that Johnny Depp is doing in Tusk. You get it in Yoga Hosers. Is is Tusk worth watching just for Johnny Depp? No. Okay. <laughs> I, here, Sadly, I'm gonna, no. I'm going to say this honestly. The TV we watched Tusk on... The audio, I don't know what the problem with that TV upstairs is, but sometimes the audio on it is awful. And I could hardly hear a fucking thing anytime Johnny Depp's character was on screen. There was a lot of other scenes I had no problem hearing. And now... There were other doors my, you could go into, Bird. Yeah, I'm, tr I'm trying to figure that out. Well, it was the one over there by the items. It's nothing that has vines on them. No, it's just, I'm trying to just figure it out and talk. Sorry. Um, but, like, I just had a hard time hearing anything he said because he talks really low in the movie. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of just hard to hear him, to be honest. And I just never picked up what he was saying. So it just, like, if he was saying something funny or interesting, like, just no, I never picked up on it. So I thought I'm not going to lie. My problems with Tusk, and, and we talked about this when we were doing Alan Wake, but I'll, I'll touch on it briefly. Like, my issues with Tusk were that it was trying to be a serious movie that was so stupid that it was funny. Yeah. And it didn't really effectively pull that off to me. Um, the best part about Yoga Hoser is that at no point does it take itself seriously. And it realizes that it's basically like a campy, dumb movie. And Well, that's because they have fucking Kevin Smith as a sausage person. Yes. Not even the dumbest part of the movie. I'm sure. Um... He's but a so is he a sausage lady? Is that what you're saying? No, he's a, he's a sausage Nazi, <laughs> I, isn't he? I yeah. know, yes. Um, all of the characters, like all of the, all of your standard Kevin Smith movie guys make an appearance as far as, you know, like like in Tusk, like how Haley Joel Osment was in it. He makes an appearance as a different character in this one. Uh, Justin Long is in it. Honestly, that's what I was going to ask. Is Dante Just or Handel in it? Uh, no, but Jay Muse is in it. Oh. Um, if if there could be an hour and thirty minute long movie of Justin Long's character just doing stupid yoga poses and talking about them, it would be like his character in Zack and Mary make a porno. Yes. He, yeah, he plays almost exactly that same character. <laughs> That's he was amazing. The best, he's one of the best parts about that movie. Just a just a flower just blowing out of shit. <laughs> Um, I still say one of the best lines I've ever heard is, I will be your Sherpa up the, the mountain, mountain of, of gayness. gayness. Yeah. And the way he says it, it's, it's, it's perfect. Or shut your mouth before I fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, his, it's his like, character... It's like Ross, more erotic. 
Um, so good. So his, character, think that's good. his character is like the yoga instructor. And they just do like they do these stupid yoga poses, and it's the most incredible thing. It's like the dissatisfied customer, and it's just like them squatting with their arms like crossed. I'm not happy with the product you've given me. Uh, so if there was like an hour and a half long version of just him doing that, what? I would fucking die. Oh, you're you're saying if there was? Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Um, his character was hilarious. Um, at first, you don't really believe that Kevin Smith's daughter and um, Johnny Depp's daughter are very good at acting. And by the time you get halfway through the movie, you're like, eh, it's okay. It's serviceable. For the characters that they're supposed to be, it's fine. Yeah. But Johnny Depp, absolutely 100%, is the movie. His character makes the movie what it is. He, they seriously pull a fucking Mel Brooks gag. Like, he has a mole on his, he has three moles on his face. You know where this is going. He has three moles on his face, and every time they switch camera angles, the mole is in a different spot. A fucking course. At the end of the movie, a it's on the tip course. of his fucking nose. Shut your fucking I'm mouth. I'm dead serious. Oh, my like, God. Like, it starts out... Wasn't it, your hump on the other side? Yeah, like, <laughs> they start out, and it's, like, on his cheek, and it, like, sort of progressively... You're back in the same room you were in. I know, I'm just oh, okay. looking it for stuff. It sort of progressively moves. You didn't miss anything, though. Yeah. But, like, just... right in, like, the last... 20 minutes of the movie it just moves all over the place at one point it's like right between his eyebrows like it's just his character is so fucking funny because like his guy his character's name is guy lapointe yeah guy lapointe and um and he calls himself guy lapointe and every time he said it becky looked at me and she's like guy la douche <laughs> From MXC. <laughs> Fuck! I missed that show. Gila Douche. I love that show. So good. So um, fucking good. But they, they're they at the high school because, like, the the two girls are are supposed to try stay that in door, though. Try it now. Oh, can I go through it now? Nope. Holy Holy oh, we haven't been in here, huh? No, because no. there's the All right, original. So we're back. We know, we know where we're going now. Um, so anyway, the funniest part of the movie for me is they, he, he meets the girls at their high school because um, he's, he's basically like talking to them about... He wrote a book about, about the Tusk movie, basically, about yeah. his investigation. Okay. So it's like... So he's talking to them about that, and he brings out the book. It's in the library, and he's like... And I can't do Ooh. his accent because it's so fucking weird. Hold on. That, th that jar just says sweet candy on it. Hell yeah, it does. Sweet candy. I was I, going I, for a sweet can. I, w I was talking about how I've been wa getting caught up on Jessica Jones and Luke Cage is in it. And he says he says twice in different episodes, he just goes, sweet, sweet Christmas. Sweet Christmas, yeah. yeah. He does it in the one episode that the first half of the episode is literally just like, hey, Here's a bunch of scenes of Luke and Jessica having sex. Yeah. And it's really awkward afterwards. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm not not okay with this, but it's still weird. It's really, really intense. Yeah. Especially the first one of, like, the second episode where it's just like, I were, I'm not sure I want to say it, but, but there's a part that they talk Whoa, about in the raincoat book. raincoat, mister. Ooh, dropping he's some just seeds. Dripping, he's just dripping seeds everywhere. <laughs> He's just like pooping seeds out of his pee hole. He's dripping. He's dripping his his red sea glue goo. <laughs> oh, the red goo. seed goo! My goo! My goo! So, is he, anyway. is he just like a? He, is he just a body? I have, I figured it out. It's not a person. He's just a, a giant pile of seeds oh. manifested into a person's body. He's he's like, like that. He's like that, that Spider-Man. He's Oogie Boogie, but seeds. <laughs> He's like so that, bugs. He's like that Spider-Man villain where he's just made out of wasps. <laughs> oh shit! So anyway, I'm gonna finish my story about. Uh, yes, finish this. We gotta movies. talk about another horror movie. Um, George, I'll get right to. So the point. one of the things that happens is he pulls out the book that he made talking about the the uh, tusk, 
and it's called and his, his has his name on the front. And he's like, I see your uh, fellow students have changed it. Uh, it is not guy. It is gay. And it's, they just were like they took a big sharpie and wrote an A on his name. And then there's a picture of on the on, of him on the back. And he's like, I see they have also replaced my mustache with a pair of testicles with little hairs. And it's just like a bunch of like it's a giant nutsack hanging off his face. I fucking died. <laughs> I see our, <laughs> your fellow classmate. And like, his accent is so weird because it's not really French. It's just the best. And like, the way he said, I can't even add, like, I'm not even doing the joke justice. This is very. I do remember the one part from Tusk I thought was really funny is the part where they flashback to the old dude at the guy's ca at, at his cabin and he's got like a normal accent. Yeah. And it's just like so weird. Yeah. You know something, don't you? I'm getting us some coffee. So now Thomas is suspect number one. Yep. Because the only other person that has access to those files is Thomas, and he's missing. And by missing, you mean he's dead. And is he? He's he was dead also, already. He also asked for coffee, so obviously he's going to get a clue in the coffee. Ooh. Is he going to say FK in the coffee and then smile real weird? Nope. Ugh. Zach, this is amazing. Even the taste of her coffee is <laughs> thrilling. Thrilling? She can't, she can't even what? make coffee. It's, it's what like a, a dumb no, bitch. No. It's like a lightning bolt hit the tip of my penis. <laughs> this isn't the cup that Thomas always uses for me, is it? I'm sorry about that too, then. I just used a cup that was nearby. You have a problem with that? A problem? Not at all, my dear Emily. The coffee is perfect. <laughs> Well, okay, taste aside, this cup certainly is perfect. The fish are biting. Velvet falls. George? The clue wasn't in the coffee. It was on the coffee the mug. Falls. Oh, Something the tweet! Clean up that audio, You're fucker. Trusting your cup? I'm, nope. just, I'm just gonna throw a compressor on it like I always Going do. No. Fuck. <laughs> That's so fucking fun. It'll achieve, it'll achieve your goal, but it'll sound even. Yeah. Get ready for the best part in the whole game when yep. you go to the falls. Oh, is this where we're gonna go fishing? Yep. Fishing mini game. I hope it does not suck. It's so stupid. It's pretty satisfying. You don't fucking know. Are you too serious? George, do you have a net? George, I'm super fucking cereal right now. I want to go fishing. Oh, I'm super cereal. So, you saw that movie and we talked about it. Yes. I, I, can can we talk about another movie that we saw? Yes. What is what? the mystery of the sperm turkey baster? Can we talk about? Hold on. Can we talk about what's going on on the screen for a second? What do you mean? Look at the screen. What about it? What am I looking at? Look oh, at the right hand shit, side of the okay, screen. Yeah. What the fuck is going on there? It's a little bit of copy paste there. Somebody copy, copy pasted pussy. that. Yeah, what? Wow. Wow, wow, wee wow. Wow, wow, wee wow. So, Wait, is this another movie you guys went and saw without me? Well, I saw you. I could see that. Oh, we. Well, uh, we saw. This was. This is a whole other issue. It was um, when we came back from. When we went camping. Arlie didn't want to go home. She's like, can we just go to the movies? So we went and saw Don't Breathe. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So you did you, you saw it too? Yeah. Okay. Holy shit. Is it as good as all the trailers are making it's, it out to be? It's better. It's it, better. Does it really have like the twist end of the century? Yeah. It's pretty it's fucking a, nuts. It's a, it's a crazy twist that I feel like I'm either okay with or I'm just frustrated with it. Guffy, I want you to put in giant letters on the screen with some air horn noises that we will be spoiling this movie. But okay. wait, we gotta, we gotta do this though. We, we gotta fish first. We gotta fish first. So after we're gonna fish, <laughs> then you can spoil. Wait for the right timing to get a big hit. But if your line breaks, you'll lose one bait. So be careful. But in this part, because it's the first time you're doing it, the, it's showing you how, you're, you could break the line regardless how many times. So what is the point of... Because you have of, to do this. What, what is the point of this right now? 
It's um, fishing. But right, but is there a story mission purpose to this? Yeah, the the thing is, there's a file missing about the incident from 50 years ago or whatever. Right. It was missing from the lock from the files right. in the police station. Yes. So when they're talking about it, he gets a clue that was um, I supposed to do? Yeah, something you were supposed there? to do something. Yeah, well, it's, it's well, not. It doesn't fucking tell you. I know. So, <laughs> um, wait, no, you don't. It, it's whatever he, whatever. You'll 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 see. There you go. Um, I'm not doing anything. Yeah, you're not doing anything. You gotta wait. Um, so while they're talking about it, he asks for coffee, and because right. like always, the clue is always in the coffee. coffee. Right. He gets a coffee mug about the falls. So he's like, I gotta go to the falls. Let's go fishing. So we don't know why he's going fishing. No. That's basically what I was asking. Yeah. But you'll know why once he... I think you do have to hit a button. I am, I'm not entirely sure. I just hit back? And yeah, it's... don't hit back, though. Hit, like... Well, I'm just X. trying to hit things. I would say X or... Yeah, nothing. Everything else... Nothing. Maybe when he does that, you, like, pull the thing back, like your stick back or something. I completely forget this whole section. The controller's not rumbling. I'm hitting everything. I'm clicking in sticks. See, you failed. But oh. you did it, though. I, I don't know you what hit, I just hit. Whatever I don't you know hit, what I just hit. Whatever you hit, that's what you have to do. <laughs> All right, we're going to fast forward until we finish <laughs> no, this. Out. No, no, no. Give me, give, me, give me a second here. <laughs> Well, we're going to fast forward one way or the other, whether you're figuring it out or not. Oh, okay. 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 Now I got it. But okay. Well, okay. Go, okay. Go, go. Go. Whoa. Whoa. We're fishing now. This is what fishing's like in real life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what, what, what the fuck? You I have to stop the roulette wheel on the, um, see, look, you, you fished out a, a title card. <laughs> you fished out a picture of a candy bar. This is what fishing is in this oh, game. Oh, God. <laughs> you fucking serious? <laughs> I don't even know how I did that. Okay, so when that comes back up again, don't press anything. I'll show you what you have okay, to do. Okay, hold on. I, okay, so... <laughs> this is uh, so stupid. Okay, so <laughs> the reel is up. He's reeling it in. I'm not feeling anything this time. Ooh, okay. reel it in. Uh, uh, you have to hit uh, it on that present one. The one that's the present. Ooh. Ah. Uh. Oh, you got that. Ooh, Emily face. Oh, no, that's what you need. That's what you need. Okay. 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 All right, I got it. I the care. gift is like a random like item. Okay. 